Former Solicitor General Mohan Parasaran has spoken exclusively with Times Now and denies facing illegal pressure while in office. He says that his comments have been misunderstood but also adds that uh, it was a miracle that he survived for 10 years in office as a law officer. Days after leaving office, controversy continues to dog the UPA government. Media reports on Wednesday suggested that top law officers of the government had felt political pressure. But former Solicitor General Mohan Parasaran denies facing any illegal pressure even as he spoke of pressures on the job. Pressures means actually it's not a sort of a extraneous pressure, pressure of the job. But what I would like to say is these are all I think very sensitive matters and any advocate has a pressure, any professional has got a pressure and these are all not matters to be just discussed in public. I have already actually told but people, I think, have completely misunderstood what I have said. Under the UPA, the law ministry has been under the spotlight for all the wrong reasons several times, with Ashwani Kumar being forced to resign for wetting the CBI report on Colgate. The outgoing Solicitor General, however, is measured when asked about political pressures. Political parties are putting pressure means it is not actually they are coming and sitting with you or speaking to you. Pressure can be of so many kinds, no? Therefore, I think these are all matters which we can't speak and uh, all of us actually have argued matters and we are law officers who are answerable to court, we are actually answerable to the public and we have performed our duty. The legal fraternity also is unanimous in denying the role of political parties in influencing legal decisions. Never ever in any case did either any minister even want to talk to me or even suggest that I do something which is unpalatable to me. In fact, I would say the only pressure that can ever be exerted on a law officer is if the law officer feels that he is, you know, clinging to his chair and he should not be removed so he can succumb to pressures. If someone tried to really over-influence him, unduly influence him, which might be called pressure, he should have objected and come out in the open against that. As I said, he was a solicitor general. The attorney general is the captain of the team. He should have gone and told the attorney general. Why is he saying these things now? That's one thing which rather upsets me. The bigger question being, when is the politician, when are politicians going to stop their particular interference in legal affairs and law officers continuing in their duty? With Arjun Rawat, I'm Ridhiman Bhardwaj in Delhi for Times Now.